If Hearst boilers are included in your spec, they offer by far the best CAD files for download in a variety of formats. This is an STP file, comes in as a block reference, and along with that uh, STP file, you'll get a uh, PDF drawing showing you the connection sizes. Now, there's two different files here. Wrong. This one is without the uh, name tag on it, the Hearst Boiler logo. And this one's got the logo. Considerable difference in sizes. The other thing is they don't load up their CAD files with a bunch of unnecessary garbage like every little nut and bolt. The other thing is once you explode these down, into a 3D solid. Now you have to explode, you have to run the explode command on this twice to get it down to a 3D solid. This one is a 3D solid and that one's been combined. This one is not. And if we hide the 3D solid, you'll see these items are still block references. Well, you can rotate these around to the other side. So if you want your, uh, pressure relief discharge and your blowdown on one side and your feed water connections on the other side, it allows you to do that. Now, once you have gotten all of these uh, block references set to where you want them, then you have to explode them down to a 3D solid. And once you do that, get everything down to a 3D solid, then you select all of them and run the union command and it combines it into a complete uh, 3D solid. And now, not only do they provide boilers, I'll go over here and take a quickie look. This is a oxygenator, um, de-aerator with a feed water on it. This is just a straight feed water and this is a blowdown separator. Now, all of these come in clean with no unnecessary garbage on them. So, as I say, if you've got Hearst boilers included in your specs and they're a top-of-the-line manufacturer, they really provide good CAD files uh, for use in your models.